And yes, I have fucking acne. There you go. Zoom in. I'm that pissed. I'm that pissed. I don't care. <laughs> if you see my horrible, horrible face. I went to do my roots. I've been to this place before, and it was only once. But like I said, I'm always terrified that they'll fuck up my hair or like what if my hair falls out. And the reason I don't do it myself is because I'm terrified that I'll bleach all my hair off. And I'm like, they're the professionals. They they can, you know, hopefully not, you know, your hair won't fall out. Or, you know, they know how to do their shit. And the first time I went, I loved it. Um... And, but I was still hesitant because I'm me and I'm worried about everything, but I finally went and let's just say this time was awful. I'm, I'm fixing to try to fix up some of these patches myself, but like, I paid $70 and I'm gonna try to fix what they did and I'm probably not gonna be successful at fixing it because I'm me. And like, you know, there's a reason I go professional. Because, you know, you know, I don't, I don't want patches of hair that don't get dyed. I don't mind the yellow of it, honestly. What I mind is that that like that shit is like that shit's like brown I'm just like like I want you to like can you see the difference I get it my hair was really dark and I know there's a lot of shit that goes into it but like that's that's something you can you can tell me or be like you may have to come in another time or I don't, I don't I don't know how hair works clearly but and it's not the shadow it's not it's like light brown essentially that's like dirty blonde hair and like it's just different patches and like this looks like something I would do at home and I paid 70 bucks for someone to do this, like, if I wasn't so terrified of my hair falling out if I did it myself, because obviously I, I wouldn't be able to see, like, where my pink hair stops in certain areas because I can't see the back of my own head. That's why I go to places, but I'm just like, I don't know how I'm going to try to fix that. I really don't. I have a cheap uh, bleach dye. From a box which i don't really want to do especially not this soon i may just leave it this horrible and ugly and try to actually get like more professional ones and not just not that it doesn't work but because that's what i used when i first originally dyed my hair but that's why my hair is patchy <laughs> well the hair that i've dyed is patchy and I fucking hate that so so I'm gonna end up spending like way more money if I wasn't scared that my hair would fall out this wouldn't have happened you know what I mean but if I can fix this on my own I'm gonna try next time to do it myself at home which I know, like, every hairstyle is like, oh, don't do that, blah, 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 because you don't know what you're doing, we know things, we go to school. And I'm like, obviously, well, not obviously, because this is just a terrible experience this time. And she's a very nice lady. That's why it makes it hard. Or, like, I couldn't, I'm not a complainer. I don't complain to people. <laughs> Like, um, I don't know. It's, it's that thing where you, <laughs> you just like, like, I'm a bitch, but like, not to strangers or not to, especially people in like service industry stuff. I'm like, been there, done that. Customers are awful. And I don't want to be an awful customer, even if that is Bruce. Yes, thank you.
Yes. <laughs> Thank you for the ass and face. In all his life. <laughs> I don't know. Like, you know, like these? Like, when she first did it, my hair was like this. And I don't mind the yellow too much. It's just the, like, dark, like the orangey-ish, brownish parts. It's just, it wasn't a good day. And I was very excited. I caught a charmeleon. I was very excited before I went to go do my hair. I caught a charmeleon um, dropping off my sister at work. I was so excited. <sighs> and goal is for Charizard. And like I said, I don't leave the house much. People are probably like over that game. But I'm, I'm not, like, I don't get to leave the house much. So I haven't, I'm not like that far in it. <sighs> I'm gonna sound like such a complainer, but like, there's not many things that bring me, like, happiness in my life currently, and I have not been having a great past few months, and especially this last month, and I don't really know why, I kind of think I know why, but it has been great. <laughs> I care a lot about my hair, and like, having my pink hair. I think I literally quoted myself saying this all the time. My pink hair is the most me I've felt my entire life. And so I like to keep having my pink hair. And I know, it's just hair. It's just hair. I know. I get it. I understand. But when you only have like five things and that's one of your top five and like everything else is going to shit, it, you kind of get a little dramatic. It's, I understand. It's stupid. To people or it's dramatic but like I spend a lot of money and I'm actually very sad and I very much <laughs> regret going so like I said if I can fix the little patches which I probably won't like as long I don't care if it's like the same color I just want it to be lighter than fucking dirty blonde color like it's it's like so brown it's so brown i'm showing you my acne and i'm very insecure about it i was looking forward to being a fucking magical unicorn and i come home feeling like fucking melted ice cream that you left two days sitting on your table so I'm happy. I want to fix it right now. I'm gonna I'm gonna show you. <sighs> Nothing against splat because I use used to use it all the time. That's the bleach that I have, and I don't really like it. Like I hate it so much. I want to do that right now, but I kind of also in the back of my head I'm like maybe we should wait and at least try to find better, like a better way to fix it or. I don't know. Maybe there's something on YouTube or Google. <laughs> yeah, that's that's where I should be getting my tips. <laughs> and like, I get that sometimes you can't, like, there's only so much you can try to dye it. I understand. But like, how can I have a good experience one time? Like my hair, my natural hair be, you know, do good and then the next time it's just like, this patchy, ugly, and that's like shit that I can see, like, you probably can see more. It's like, I feel, um, like this is the type of shit that would happen if I did it myself. Of course I would never say that to her face because I would feel awful ever complaining. Like, how do you tell someone, you made me go from unicorn to old melted ice cream. The reason I finally did it was because I hated, hated seeing my, you know, my roots. Like, look how outgrown that is. You know, that's a lot of roots. And now I can't have it pink yet. <laughs>
these two first pictures, one in my room and one in my bathroom, so you can see the difference in lighting, which is not much, it's still ugly brown, and the rest are just different angles of my hair, so you can see the orange spots, the really blonde spots, and the brown spots, and this next one, black spots, my natural hair color. <laughs> he loves to show his ass.